here at Fodden Company. We've been in business over 65 years. We built some of the largest stadiums, airports, malls, hospitals, and bridges in this area. Most of the structures that we build are encompassed with wide flange shapes, angles, tubes, round pipes, and other pieces. Before we had the XPR system, we struggled with being competitive on jobs that had pipe and tube and plate. This has allowed us to do things faster, more accurate, and be more competitive in the market. And because of the speed and accuracy, we're able to get work that normally we wouldn't be able to get. So we have a higher market share. We haven't done a lot in pipe before, not in these type of cuts. But with Rotary 2 Pro, the nesting is quite simple. It's basically just importing the parts, put the parts together that you want to come out of a stock piece of length, one button, and it nests it, and it's ready to go. On the fish mouth parts, it will lock the pieces together. When it nests these fish mouths together, then you're saving a lot of material. With the Rotary 2 Pro, we no longer have to outsource any fish mouth cutting. Now we can do this all in the machine. The quality of the cuts are very, very good. My experience with the SBR so far has been uh, very positive and good. It was easy to learn and very easy to, to operate and, and to use. The quality of the parts and the actual dimensions and sizes are very accurate, very precise. One of the things that I like most about the machine is once the product has been cut, it's done. There's no more cleanup, there's no more grinding, knock a little slag off and go right to work. We save time and money, lots of time and money. Before we had the Pipotherm XPR, we would have to lay things out with a template and then either cut it most likely with an oxyacetylene torch. So what would take eight to 16 hours, we now do in less than an hour. We are currently building one of the world's largest track and field arenas. It has components that aren't typically part of a regular steel project. It has pipes that sit on the backside, big plate columns that come up that we have to manufacture by pieces. And without the XPR, we would be cutting, grinding, hacking things apart, trying to get it so it was done right. And I don't believe that we've been able to be competitive and get that project without the XPR system that we've chose to use.